going to get ready to go to the salvage yard. I'm gonna go down to the salvage yard, I think tomorrow, to get something for the flare side. And what it is I'm going to get is a rear brake drum. This one is warped. So I'm gonna go down there tomorrow and get a new one, or a, a new to me one, a used one. I do have a doctor's appointment first thing tomorrow morning at 9.30, and then I'm gonna head down there directly after that. As I may have mentioned before, this brake drum is warped, and when it starts, they self-adjust, and when it starts touching the drum, it starts shaking, and it'll shake the whole damn truck. So what I've been doing for the past, I don't know how long, while, is just adjusting this. It's just taking this and adjusting the brake out, and then it will, uh, and then it'll be good for a while. But, I get tired of doing this. The brake doesn't work. And eventually, it's gonna start hitting again. So I'm gonna go down to the salvage yard and see if I can find one. I looked online, should be able to get one for like $12 from the salvage yard. All right, got that taken care of. Wasn't really catching too much right now, but I didn't want to run into a problem with it catching while I was down in Des Moines. I'm gonna leave those in there just in case I need them. Hopefully tomorrow I can find one that isn't warped. Not a bad day here in central Iowa. Actually, it is pretty darn nice compared to what it has been. I don't know what the temperature is right now, probably in the 20s, but it feels like summertime. And it feels like summertime because the last few days have been darn cold. It was down to 15 below, I don't know, two or three nights ago. It's been really windy and just generally crappy. So, gonna get some tools rounded up for this little salvage yard adventure tomorrow. One thing I'm pretty sure I'm going to need is this hammer. Really shouldn't need a lot more than that to get the drum off. Perhaps a can of penetrating lube. Um, not much in that one. Or that one. Or that one. Um, hmm. I guess I'll take this one. I need to get more of this, it appears. She loved him, though he was good. He took her down to Chinatown and showed her how to kick her back. Other than that, I really don't know what else I would need. The, the wheels are already off of the trucks down there, so it's just the drum that will be hung up on there. Probably the screwdrivers in the flare side back the brake off and then beat the crap out of it until it comes off. A little penetrating oil might come in handy, but probably not even necessary. Don't forget about the license plate wall. Haven't received any plates for a while. I've had, uh, I think I know of two or three that are coming in. But as far as that goes, or anything else you want to send to the channel, the address is in the descriptions below. Not a whole lot going on with the green truck. I uh, don't really have any big plans for it. I am going to be fixing this soon and someone has mentioned in the comments that they are wanting to do their headliner 
and waiting for me to make a video showing how to do that. I'm, uh, it's one of those things I keep thinking about, but I don't think about it real long. I gotta get some fabric, haven't really decided what style of fabric I'm going with yet, but I will be getting that done shortly. Another thing I would like to do on this truck real soon is upgrade that. Yes, it's still rocking the original sound system with the exception of the door speakers. I replaced, I replaced those several years ago. I believe it has Pioneer speakers in it now, if I remember correctly. But I would like to get something that could use Bluetooth so I can play music off of my phones and possibly upgrade the speakers, amp, that kind of thing. If you are a member of OBS Revolution on Facebook, myself and another guy, that's our page on there, and I, you might have seen in one of the comments, somebody was asking about if anybody had a factory, it was either 91 or 92, I don't remember now, factory stereo for sale, and I commented that I'm still using mine. Somebody else commented that they're still using theirs as well, the only exception is theirs had a CD player in it, which you don't see very often. I look every time I go to the salvage yard and I have never found one. If I ever see one, I'm gonna pick it up. So this was a pretty short video, kind of leading up to tomorrow. I probably could have ran them both together, but I thought I'd go ahead and put this one up anyway. Tomorrow should be a little better. Salvage yard videos are always interesting. I do have another edition coming to the channel. It's something that, well, it's a Christmas present. It's something, but I already, I already know what it is. It's something that I have mentioned on the channel before, something I've been wanting to get for some time now. Just couldn't get myself to part with the money. And now I know I'm getting it for Christmas, but I can't open it till Christmas. You probably know what it, what that is. It's something that I can use to, something I can use to help create videos. And it, it, it should be a thumbs up. So give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below, subscribe if you haven't already, and we'll catch you next time. Bye bye. She messed around with a pope named Smokey. She loved him, though he was cocaine.